Yo, what's up? This is Soph from Weird. So I haven't uploaded on this channel for five years. I'm not in the UK. I'm currently in Montreal in Canada. And I'm here for a year abroad with my university. And yeah, I thought I'd make the most of this year and, I don't know, record, document what I'm doing. What it's like for an international student to live abroad in somewhere like Canada. And I've never been to Canada before, so it's, it's a new experience. I've been here for about a month and a half now. So I'm sure it's really interesting for like the 10 people watching. And it's just mad being in like a completely different country on the opposite side of the world like I'm still getting used to it even though I've been here for over a month just a bit mad but yeah I've had an amazing time so far I spent Thanksgiving with my mates grandparents which is really nice we went kayaking <laughs> been on a really nice hike and just generally exploring the city Well, one thing that's completely different is the pint prices so yeah we were at a pub last night and I'd say I spent I think it was like seven pound fifty Per pint. My foot my oh, oh my sorry, is on my strong is on my horse. Oh my god, he does it from oh my god. Like, if I was in the UK and it was £7.50 per pint, I would leave the pub immediately and never go back. Like, I would feel sick to my stomach, I would never pay that price. But you know, I'm here for a year, I might as well make the most of it. But it is bloody expensive, i tell you that. Yeah, I think I'll just be recording and documenting different things that I get up to here. Give you a bit of an insight to what it's like to be an international student. Also, I do realise that I'm walking about in a forest on my own. I promise I've made friends. I promise. I'm also embracing the Canadian look with this beautiful moustache. Yo, so it's the next day, Monday today, I've got three lectures today, I've got a very busy day. Do a bit of work, go to my lectures, maybe go to the gym later, it's a very boring day today. Now I'm going to go get some breakfast because I'm f***ing starving. I hate it. My name's Mime, I won't disclose my last name for legal reasons. Hello, I'm Mime, I've also got IBS. Nice. <laughs> 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 Right, so I've just had my first lecture of the day. Very, very boring. But I just walked past a hotel a couple of weeks ago. The uh, Boston Celtics were playing at. And I, uh, I walked past, I think it's called Jason Tatum. So that was pretty cool. Uh, I don't know anything about basketball, but I'm a bloody celebrity, mate, so. So here's the gym in all its glory. Pretty decent gym. And there's usually no one here, so bloody lovely. So yeah, I'm gonna do some arms, shoulders, triceps, biceps. It is Halloween weekend, so I am a bit hungover. But let's get this workout in. Let's get it. Trying to ball with my bros. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm getting ready for a hand of potato. What do you miss the most about me? Uh, that's a really hard one. I don't miss anything. Okay. What's the most about me? Nothing. Yeah. Alright, so I've just come back from the gym, had some food, and now I think I'm gonna go for a shopping on my own, on my wine. I did ask if Will wanted to come, but he's a bit too hungover. And he, he took a bit of a fall last night, bless him. <laughs> so I'm gonna go on my own, get some fresh air in my system. Uh, yeah, hopefully we can find some nice stuff. So yeah, let's go. So I've been going around the shops and made one purchase. This nice jumper. Ooh, I really like it. Very nice. It's like 20 quid, I think. This is like the, the cheapest jumper I could get, really. 20 quid. Everything else was like $50. Something like that. It's ridiculous. So I think I'm just going to stick with this. And yeah, man. Happy. Very 
random, but one thing that is annoying about living in Canada is the time difference in the UK. Like, we're five hours behind, so, for example, in the World Cup, for some games, I'm going to have to get up for, like, five in the morning. So when Wales are in the final, and Gareth Bale scores a winning goal, I'm going to have to get up really early. That's the coolest fucking story I've ever heard in my entire life. That's insane. Can I hear it again? Do you have time? But yeah, after that random point, I think I'll stop the video here. Uh, I don't really know what this video is. I'm just trying to get back into, you know, editing and making videos. So this is a very random video, but I hope it was a good watch. Um, I'll definitely be doing more. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you are new. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Peace!